Hi guys, my name is Matthew Pierce and I'm from Serenity Marine. We're located in Wangara, uh, 57 Challenge Boulevard, just north of Perth. And today I'm going to show you one fantastic 26 foot Whitley. These boats are absolutely fantastic. They're built in Australia and they're built for the Australian conditions. Uh, it's one of the only legal, legal trailer boats that can be towed on the road. Um, this one sits on a double axle aluminium trailer, licensed to three and a half tonne. It's got electric brakes and it's in really good condition. So I'm just going to walk around the back of the boat. I'm going to climb on board um, and we're going to show you some of the fetches as we go. Whitley boats all come standard with trim tabs. Uh, this has got some beautiful stainless steel tabs fitted on it uh, with your hydraulic Bennett trim tabs. Um, as you come around the back, you'll see the condition of the boat. Um, the boat's never been any foul. Uh, it's got a Bravo 2 leg fitted. Uh, Mercury, so this boat's got a Mercury installed. It's got plenty of grunt. Um, been on this boat quite a few times. Uh, it does about 32 knots flat stick and it rides absolutely gorgeously. Um, I'm just going to climb on and I'm going to show you some of the features that this owner's put on. He spent a lot of money on this boat, especially with the bar work and the stainless and it really does add to the, the boat. Okay, so the swim platform on the back of this boat is absolutely gorgeous. It's, it's, it's large, it makes, you know, for fishing, uh, swimming, uh, entertaining, it, it really is fantastic and they've spent a lot of money on it. So full bar work all around the back, gives you that extra security so you're not gonna fall off. Um, with the door, you can actually lift it up, close it down, so once again, very sturdy. Um, large bait board fitted, stainless steel gas bottle holder, stainless steel barbecue. The one thing about this barbecue, there's a lot of barbecues on the market are quite small. This one's actually quite large, so you can cook for everybody. Um, it's got a little holder at the front for your utensils. Really, really is a great barbecue, sovereign. Um, okay, so. The other features as well is he's put a rear awning on with the stainless at the back, once again with your rocker holders for your rods, so plenty of rod storage. Um, he's also actually added a full stainless steel roof rack so you can put on your, your surfboards, you can put on your, um, your long boards, you can put on the uh, paddle board, your, your tubes, all your skiing equipment, a tender for a rot nest, get it all up the top and out of the way. Um, the other good feature about the back of the boat on the marlin board. Okay, you've got this little compartment here. Um, at the moment, and it's, it's actually self-draining, so it does drain out to the bottom of the boat. At the moment, he's got his earmuffs and there's also a deck shower, um, which actually plugs it plugs in over here. So wash, so easily wash down. You can clean your fish, um, and then obviously for your barbecue. <coughs> I'm going to invite you guys. Now Whitley's really do build a beautiful vessel, okay? Um, just the layout of the rear deck is absolutely gorgeous. It's got a beautiful sunbed, full wraparound couch. Um, one of my favourite spots in this boat would certainly be at the back of this boat. Curled up in the corner there with a beer, uh, reading a book, relaxing, fishing. Um, the wife can sit down and read a book while hubby fishes. Really, really is, is a good layout. Um, the transom door, once again, very cleverly designed. Uh, the transom door actually folds down and becomes a step into the, the rear deck here. Um, but obviously, as you're underway, you basically fold that up, clip that in, and you're nice and secure. Now, one thing I do like about this is the depth. Um, so if you are fishing, you're actually really safe. The gunnels, the depth is, is, is really good. Um, now, another fantastic feature is uh, the side cushion. It lifts up, you got a little couple of little rods under here, folds out, and basically you've got the additional seating. And you've now got a beautiful size U-shaped couch for all your family, all your friends. Um, and with a little bit of modifications, you can actually put a cushion in here and turn this into a full bed. Um, seats, helm seat. One thing I like about the helm seat is uh, you and your partner can both fit on this seat. So, you know, if you want to go for that cruise up and down the river in the middle of the sunset, 
You can both comfortably sit on the seat, enjoy each other's company, glass of wine and beer, and really enjoy it. Um, hard top, once again, makes the boat absolutely gorgeous. Um, very dry boat. Um, so when the weather turns a little bit horrible, if you're stuck out in it, you can easily come home in this vessel and not get drenched. Um, windows either side, sound system, um, the beautiful vinyl seats, um, obviously the navigator's chair, single pair. One of my other favorite features is the sunroof. Okay, so the sunroof opens quite easily. I'll just push a button. Okay, and you've basically got all your air come through. Um, it really does, you know, you can get the weather in, the sun in. Um, it really does feel like a really nice sports boat. I'm gonna leave that open. Okay, the dash is absolutely gorgeous. Once again, full instrumentation. Uh, Lawrence sounder, fusion remote control uh, for your stereo, uh, your radio for your VHF. Okay, sports steering wheel. Um, you've got your water gauge on there, electric anchor switch. Um, so everything is all ready at the touch of a button. Um, so you just have a look at the rear deck. It's, as you can see, it's in absolutely excellent condition. You know, it's a compliment to the owner. This has really, really been looked after. Now I'm just gonna take you into the lower part of the boat. Okay, once again, um, very well looked after. Microwave, sink, hot cold water, fridge freezer, uh, plenty of cupboard space, um, beautiful interior. This actually drops into a bed. Um, you can fit a table in here as well. So if you wanted to, if you're at Rotnest, um, the weather's a little bit horrible outside, you can come down here and enjoy, you know, this sort of area. Um, plenty of room for a big TV. Uh, hasn't actually got a TV at the moment. Um, You've got your hatch to get outside. Um, this actually comes with a full sunbed as well, so it basically all clips down on the front and you can actually, you know, sunbake out on the top deck. Um, you know, cruise up and down the river with your guests. Absolutely stunning, gorgeous. Um, I'll just, so toilet and shower, you probably have to come in the boat. So toilet, shower, electric toilet, Uh, this boat's got a holding tank for rot nest um, and the pen. If you wanted to pen this boat, you could quite easily. Um, it's absolutely amazing boat. Um, Whitley's, like I said, in one of my favourite boats. Um, just the finishings, uh, they really do build a fantastic boat. Um, there's a little fan up there. Should it get really hot and you want to keep yourself cool. All the switches, lights, um, stainless steel railing on the top of your for your little knickknacks, it's such a great idea because it stops everything falling off when you're driving. Um, if you'd like to view this boat, like I said, it's at our yard at 57 Challenge Boulevard in Wangara. My name's Matthew Pierce. I can be contacted on my mobile 0488 026244 or on our landline 9309 5008. Thanks very much for watching the movie. Um, if you have any questions in regards to this boat or any others we've got for sale, please give me a call. Thanks very much.